Good offense is obviously been kind of scuffling these first four weeks. Is there any amount of frustration among the offensive guys about just trying to get it uh, together? Um, you know, we just definitely just want to come out and play well. There's no frustration, you know. We're not just – everything didn't click last game for it, and we just going to practice hard and try to get it going this weekend against Auburn. Great, Josh. Coach, you mentioned that you guys are – when you've got a teammate like Steven who seems to be struggling a little bit with his confidence and with his play, what do y'all do to try to talk him up or do you do anything? Just leave him alone. Nah, you know, we're definitely a team where we like to pick the guys up. You know, and anytime we see somebody struggling or going through hard times, you know, we, we're a big family. So we try to, you know, lend a hand to them. We, we just say positive things and keep them up to beat. Is it, is it easy, back here, is it easier to stay a little bit upbeat just – Thinking that, I mean, at some point you would think that this has got to get better, right? Yeah, of course. You know, I'm, we're definitely not disappointed. We're 4-0. You know, um, um, got a lot to look forward to. You know, only with us playing not as good as we should, we believe that we can do nothing but get better. Uh, a follow-up on Stephen. Do you think he's struggling confidence-wise? What do you think of the issue is with not hitting as many passes as he's hit last year? It just... I think it's just something to do with the beginning of the season, you know, different coverages and things like that. I mean, I, I really believe that he has a lot of confidence, and his confidence isn't low. I think he's just struggling right now, you know, and he's going to get through it. There's no doubt in my mind that um, Steven's not going to be a leader for us this year and, and, and lead us to um, victories. Um, do you look at this weekend's game, and even though it's, it's a much different team than, one, than what won the national championship last year, you just kind of go Auburn again? Uh, we're looking forward to playing Auburn, you know. We look forward to playing everybody we play each and every um, week. So with it being Auburn, we look at it as an SC contest and a big game. Each week is a big game. Terrence, you talked about being um, um, 4-0, but still areas for improvement. Well, what's it going to take for you guys to keep you know, playing a little better each game, and where do you really think you need to improve the most? Um, things that's going to help us play better each game is just – Togetherness, you know, we're we're gonna get hit our passes, and if they're there. We're just not connecting with them right now. We're gonna open up holes, continue to try to open up holes for markers. You know, we have great players. We have great players. You know, as offensive line, we just want to try to play as best as we can play up front. Terrence, just uh, one more question about Garcia. Is has his demeanor in the huddle changed at all? I mean, are there any indications that maybe he's just putting a little extra pressure on himself? No, his demeanor is not changing at all. He still comes out there. You still see the fire in his eyes. You still see the passion to try to um, complete them passes, to try to make a big play. He just, he maybe right now he's just trying a little too hard to make the um, big play. And that's that's just with being a quarterback. You know, you want to make the plays out there. You want to lead your team to victory. And right now he's just trying to do a little too much here and there. But Steven is fine. He's, he has no confidence, problem, confidence problem, problems at all. Coach Berger said that um, Coach Elliott was frustrated with the offensive line play last week. What, what are some of the things he said to y'all, and what are some of the things y'all have been working on? Uh, he just said we didn't play well. You know, as a, as a group, as a unit, we didn't play well last week. You know, they really got after us up front, and um, he just told us that it's, it's, we got a W. You know, it all comes down to wins and losses, and we was able to pull off a win because our great our defense played. And we got another good team win. And this week, he just said, come out and get better. So we're going to try to get better each and every day in practice. Terrence, um, is it at all frustrating that you're having to answer questions about what's gone wrong when you guys are 4-0? Because, I mean, it's not like that happens all the time around here. Nah, it's not a problem at all. I mean, we're happy to be 4-0. And, and as a team, we know we can do better. You know, especially as an offense, we know that we can play a lot better than what we're playing right now, and we're just we're happy to be sitting at four zero. That's the main thing is that we have four four victories and zero losses right now. Is there a revenge factor with Auburn? They beat you pretty bad the last time you played. They beat you twice. On the other hand, it's such a different team than it was a year ago. Does revenge play into your minds at all this week? Revenge does not play in our mind. Of course, you know, with them beating us two times last year and us never beating Auburn at all, you know, in history, this would definitely be a big win for us. And we're gonna, we're just going to come out and play hard. We're going to come out and do all out there on the field 
And we're going to try to, you know, let the squad take care of itself. Fairness 33 team. But in that sense, South Carolina hasn't beaten Auburn in the SEC. Do you guys feel that's maybe one of the last steps as a program towards establishing itself in the league? Sure. I think the last step would be for us to win the SEC championship. I mean, beating Auburn would, would be great. And it'd be another step towards our goal. But you know, that SEC West team, you know, we're SEC East team, so we're just looking to go out there and get another W.